TNG, the next generation, a genealogy application. This video is brought to you by the Alberta Family History Society through their website feature familygenes.ca. Let's get started. First of all, TNG is the creation of Darren Lithgow. He is the person that has done all the design, programming, and support of the next generation for the rest of us to enjoy. What is TNG? That stands for the next generation. It's an internet-based genealogy application, but it contains all of the features of a standard family tree software. You might be used to Family Tree Maker, Legacy, PAF, the Master Genealogist, and you will find that TNG pretty well contains all of the functionality of other such applications. But the neat aspect of TNG is that it makes all of these features available to others across the Internet. It does require a website to run. What is Family Genes? This is a website that has been created by the Alberta Family History Society based in Calgary, Alberta, with members across Alberta and other areas. We have decided to put together a repository for people to post their family trees, stories, and photos on the Internet. This becomes an archiving area for preserving people's family history. So whether you're struck by flood, fire, loss of files, or other calamities, Family Genes will be a place where families can be confident that their digital memories, photographs, and documents will be preserved. Because it is internet-based, it becomes a portal for other family members to access this information wherever they may reside. The Family Genes website will have all the tools and the TNG application already installed, ready for you to start your family history. You will be given an administration username and password to start with. Your personal website will be at .familygenes.ca where the leading part, or the prefix, of the web URL, that represents your surname of research. For example, my TNG website is weber.familygenes.ca because I am researching my mother's family line, Weber. There will be several videos for you to help set up and to run your very own family tree on the Internet. Video number two will be an overview tour of a working TNG website. Video number three is starting from scratch with your first person or video number four will export a family tree GEDCOM file and video number five will import the GEDCOM file into TNG. Video, video number six explains how to change the appearance of your TNG site. Video number seven and beyond will get into the basics of administrating your site. Starting from scratch or from a GEDCOM file? Do you already have a GEDCOM file? If the answer is yes, then go to video number 5, importing GEDCOM into TNG. If no, then decide whether you want to use a GEDCOM file from your existing family tree software. If you do decide to use the information from your existing computer, a GEDCOM file is the safest and the fastest way to populate TNG with people and families. Go to video number 4 to learn how to export your data into a GEDCOM file, then go on to video number 5. Now, if you do not want to create a GEDCOM file, or you just want to start your family tree information from the beginning, then go right to video number 3 and start from scratch. Before starting, Remember from the Family Genes video to have at least one user registered on your TNG website. That can be you. This makes sure that your TNG site is safe from outside visitors and intruders trying to register as the administration. Okay, you are now ready to set up your first families. <laughs> 